Hi, welcome to Why These Notes. Uh, so we've built our major scale, and now we're going to build a minor scale. I'm going to leave all of this stuff here because this stuff is actually quite relevant to creating the minor scale. Uh, so just to quickly recap, we discovered that one third of the length of string is so, and one fifth of the length of string is me. Uh, the full length of string, one half and one quarter, and so on, is do. Uh, and then by simply taking this major uh, chord and building it on top of do, fa, and so, and fa, remember, is just an upside down uh, so, we were able to find all of the notes in the major uh, in the major scale. So the same way that. Uh, the discovery of Fa was made by uh, discovering Do, uh, So, uh, as the difference between So and Do. Uh, the minor third, minor Mi, which we call May, is discovered uh, the same way. It's actually the distance between Mi and So. Uh, and you may have heard that, uh, you know, a chord is stacked thirds, uh, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a minor third and a major third, uh, and this is sort of, uh, I guess this is, this is a slightly different way of thinking of that. So um, here is the major third, uh, me, and it's four o'clock on our musical scale. Uh, but to get to, from me to so, we need a minor third. So if we simply move our me, up to Do, we get a minor third here. We call this May. I hope you can read that. Uh, I'm using a, a slightly different color to differentiate the minor scale from the major scale. Uh, so here, this is uh, this is also, by the way, one sixth of the length of string uh, over here. Right? So this is uh, May, uh, the minor third. And again, the same way we built the major uh, scale by moving uh, our chord, right? This is a chord around to, so let's put this May here, uh, around to Fa and So. Uh, we do the same thing again. So move Do over to Fa, right? So now. Uh, instead of la, la, we have la, right, which is the minor version of la. And then if we move this around to the so position, we have uh, te, which is the minor version of t. Uh, so we have here now uh, on the same, you know, scale, uh, both the major uh, me. La and T, and the minor, uh, Me, Le, and Te. And uh, a lot of musicians seem to get hung up on, you know, this idea of there being a Dorian mode or an Aeolian mode. Uh, and I really just sort of think of all of the minor modes as, um, you know, you have the minor here, right? This is what makes it minor, is the minor Me instead of, uh, Me instead of Me. Uh, but then, whether or not you choose to go major or minor on top of fa or so, uh, it really sort of depends on context. Um, and there's different reasons, uh, you know, you would, you would choose to do this uh, that, again, I'll get into a little bit in a, in a later episode. Um, but this is basically how we build the minor scale. Uh, and again, it's, it's after we've built out the major scale, um, it's the discovery of the minor third as the distance between me and so, and then repeating the process for the major scale, building the minor chord, uh, you know, on top of do, fa, and so, that allows us to uh, have the minor scale. Uh, and again, uh, you know, for me the most important thing is having the minor third uh, on top of do, whether or not you decide to keep the minor third on top of fa or the minor third on top of so uh, is, is sort of an aesthetic choice. Um, but, you know, again, a lot of people get hung up on, on the idea of uh, 
there being a natural minor and uh, you know a Dorian minor and uh, you know these different sort of modal minors and they go well wait a minute you know there, there was a, a natural you know major seventh in there or you know a major sixth how, how can that be um, but again really it, it, it's as long as this minor here it is here uh, I don't get too hung up on whether or not it's Dorian or Aeolian or you know whatever uh, other kinds of minor modes there are natural minor harmonic minor melodic minor um, these are all sort of different expressions of the minor mode um, and these you know they call them the imperfect intervals these do fa and so were the first intervals we discovered if you remember uh, you know so being one third the length of string and then fa being you know the the uh, difference between one third and and uh, one quarter, um, or you know, three quarters. So if this is two thirds, this is three quarters. Uh, this would be three quarters. Um, you know, people get a little bit too hung up on, um, you know, like making everything relatable to the natural, uh, the natural quote unquote versions of the scales, uh, or being a specific mode of the scales, but really. You know, these notes are kind of up for grabs, depending on, on what it is you're trying to accomplish, and whether the I would consider the key major or minor would really just be the position of the mi me. Um, you know, other people might disagree with me, but that's sort of the way I think of it. Uh, so again, this is building the minor scale uh, after we built the major scale, and let me know if you have any questions.